So what's going on YouTube, man? I know it's been a minute, man. Um, I'm down in Mississippi right now. <sighs> of all the places in the world, you know what I'm saying? I, I, I grew up here as a kid, and you can never pick where you came from. But every time I come to this place down here, I tell you, it's like going back in time. <laughs> I, you know? And I'm not trying to down it, but it's just... I don't know. I, you, I guess you just have to come here to see what I'm talking about. But anyways, let me go ahead and go to a topic. Got a topic for you. How many people invest in themselves? And the type of investment I'm talking about is not like, hey, let me take some money and invest in it. Well, it is like that in, in a sense. Here's the thing. So I told you guys I'm reading the book, uh, Power of Self-Discipline by Brian Tracy, which is a powerful book. And I'm telling you right now, um, if you can apply those things in your life, man, just just the things that he talks about and as far as how to handle tasks and how to go throughout the day and things, man, I can tell that that definitely can set you up for success because it's well, one, it's it's a it's a experiment done by people who have already succeeded, you know. But anyways, he has this rule called the three percent rule. Now, what's the 3% rule? 3% rule. So, let's just say you make $20,000 a year. Okay? $20,000 a year, um, 3%, I think that comes to be around, an uncle, it's probably $600. Okay? But anyways, you take that $600 and you invest it in yourself like this. You go out and you buy books that are in your field uh, as far as employment. Uh anything that you need to imp improve yourself but make sure you spend six hundred dollars the reason for that is this when you spend that money that money is supposed to make you better the example he had a student the reason why I used the twenty thousand dollars because he had a student that came to him and he Brian Tracy told him about the three percent rule student tried it next time he came to Brian Tracy's meeting he said look I started your 3% rule. He said, I saw my income increasing dramatically. When he came back and saw Brian Tracy, he was a million dollar guy, million dollars a year. He said, this is what I did. Instead of investing the 3%, I said, look, if I invest 3% and I can get these kind of returns on my, my money, as far as, you know, gaining knowledge and things of that nature, hey, I'm gonna bump it up to 5%. I'll we'll see what that can give me. Then he went from five to 10. So here's the funny thing. When he made it to 10, he was making a million dollars a year. So Brian Tracy asked him, look, how are you able to spend 10% of money on yourself? He said, easy. He said, I go to international, he said, I go to international conferences uh, in my field. I go to conferences all over. You know, um, he said, I have an image coach. I have a sales coach, a fitness. He had all these things where he was just grooming himself, working on himself. So here's the question. Are you doing that? Are we doing that? Are you doing anything to better yourself? Because here's the thing. How can you get great if you don't get great? I'm going to say that again. How can you get great if you don't get great? Because think about it. You, in order for you to become a better salesperson or a better person at your job, you have to increase your skills. You have to know how to go into the sales. You know, if a person usually doesn't buy something, nine times, well, I wouldn't say nine times out of 10, seven times out of 10, it's probably not because of them. It's because of you, the way you approach them, the way you approach the sale and things of that nature. So guy, I'm gonna adopt the 3% rule. I'm going to invest in myself. If there's something I wanna do, because immediately when I got that thought, I say, okay, I'm, I'm starting my new business um, here, and um, I'm gonna start. Oh, next year. So I'm like, hey, I'm about to improve myself. So what I did, I went out and got another book on guerrilla marketing tools. Man, if you're a businessman, buy that book, buy the whole guerrilla marketing series. But what I'm reading right now, the guerrilla marketing tools, powerful. A lot of things I didn't get and didn't dot the I's and cross the T's in my business. So, but hey, this is gonna be new things I'm gonna add on. It's about learning, it's about becoming better. 
If you're not doing that, you're wasting time. If you're not learning and doing and becoming better every day, not two or three days a week, every day, because that's all you have is the day that you, you're, li you're living and you're walking on earth right now. That's it. So that's what I'm going to leave you with, guys. You know, just some food for thought, give you a little homework, a little something to do. You know, I got I to gotta go to work and uh, make some money. You know what I'm saying? Getting, getting pretty anxious about my trip to China and Nepal here coming up. So, sorry for the delay, guys. Uh, please subscribe to the channel. It's your first time here. Nice seeing you again and talking to you guys. So, until next time, signing off.